Hi, I'm Jacob and I'm here at the 2024 Hellberg Games and what looks like a wonderful day for ducks. I'm a What Now reporter as well as a Hellberg Games participant. So let's go and see what we can see at the Hellberg Games. Oh. See what this is like. Oh wow. Well done man, one point in it, one point in it. Eliza Hovolder just been named to go to the Olympics. That's, she wants to chat. That's amazing. Yeah. Ah. Ah. So I'm here with John and he's going to tell us a little bit about what the Hellberg Games is. So the Hellberg Games is a fun three or four day uh, sport festival mm -hmm. for young people aged 8 to 21 across the country mm -hmm. with a physical or vision impairment. Mm -hmm. And we come together and have a lot of fun play a lot of sport, lots of games, so it's about coming, having a good time, meeting new people and making new friends. What is your favourite bit about the Halberg game? Um, how there's lots of opportunities. You get to compete in like all these different sports and it's just really fun. Having fun and taking part in lots of different sports. I'm going to try out wheelchair basketball. I've only done this once or twice and that was a while ago, so we're going to see if I'm still rusty or not. Getting it really close a lot of the time, hitting the net. I'm just so close. I feel like this might be the next go. This one, we'll try, we'll try. I'm here with Dylan, who's a member of the Halberg Youth Council. Hey Jacob, how are you? What is the Halberg Youth Council? So it's a group of New Zealanders across the country with physical disabilities who advocate for in the sport and recreation space. So we talk to a lot of big politicians, organisations, just around what they could do better to make sport more inclusive in New Zealand. Awesome. And just as a bonus challenge for you, name three sports at the Hellberg Games. Go. Cool. Um, um, uh, swimming. Swimming. Shot put. Swimming. Gymnastics. Wheelchair rugby. Running. Running. Wheelchair basketball. Wheelchair basketball. Distress. Biking? Oh, <laughs> Running. Like outdoor bowls, but you're on a chair. I can't remember what it's called. And botcha. Oh, the botcha. We just did that, didn't we? We're back here with Dylan and we're here at the Botcher because I've never played this. He's going to teach me how to play. Very simple game, very similar to something like a bowls or a baton style of game. You each take turns to throw the ball to start off with. The person who is closest to the jack wins. So let's get into it, shall we? I'm ready to beat you. Oh, Having him score. He's just too good, man. His first throw was just right on the jack. Yeah. I think I need to up my game a bit. Eat a bit more wheat mix. I reckon I've only scored two. Oh. You still win. Oh. <laughs> well done, right. man. One point in it. One point in it. Here's a challenge for you. Try and make me laugh. Make me laugh. Can you try and make me laugh? <laughs> okay. Why do bees have sticky hair? Why? Because they use a honeycomb. What do you have to be careful of when it's raining cats and dogs? I don't know. You just have to be careful not to step in a poodle. Oh! Knock knock. Who's there? Interrupting cow. Interrupting. Moo! Oh. oh, this is a cracker. Okay. Why did the dinosaur go to the park? Why? Because he needed the go run <laughs> Get it? Yeah, I got it. Name a word that rhymes with Halberg. What rhymes with Halberg? I don't know. Oh, okay. Um, let me have a real deep think. That's a hard one. What does? What? <laughs> no. One that I can think of. Halberg. Schmalberg. <laughs> what are you competing in today? I'm doing a wheelchair slalom race, which is basically like a wheelchair obstacle course. I'm doing that too. Oh, cool. Well, I think I'll see you there. Yeah. How long before your race? Uh, I think it's about 10 minutes ago now. Not nervous at all. I think the weather will actually help with wheelchair traction. Good to get out there and give it my best shot. So I am here with Eliza McCartney, Olympic pole vaulter 
and has just qualified into the Paris Olympics. How are you? I'm great. Thanks for having me here yeah, today right. out in all the weather conditions. So what's been your favourite event you've seen here today? Oh, I mean, we've only got races happening because of the weather, but it's been fantastic so far. We've had the juniors out there, haven't we? Um, the yep. slalom's pretty fun. Yeah. I like that one. That's a, that's a bit of me. Is it just us? Is it just us? Let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Go, Jacob. You got it. <laughs> And also, um, you've just been uh, qualified into the Olympics. How are you feeling about that? Very excited, yeah. as you can imagine. Very, very excited. The games are what three, four months away. It's such an honour to get to go to the Olympics to represent Aotearoa. So yeah, I'm yeah, very happy. Awesome. Thanks, Eliza. <laughs> yeah, pretty tired. Didn't think, didn't think I'd get this tired. Woo. Doing the cones was probably my favourite bit. Making sure I didn't tip over it was really fun. And just to have us two, that was that was real fun. Hopefully my hair doesn't wash out. Hello. And that's been Jacob reporting at the See you next year. Oh. If you like this video as much as I did, subscribe now. Please. Thank you.